All right, so I'm just talking to make sure. Maybe you guys should go ahead and subscribe. To the limit. What is up guys, we're back with another proximity mod video. Now today's video I'll be showing you guys how to download and install this new crew link proximity mod. Now I want to shout out to the creators of this mod called automated now they are a super cool team that made this mod if it wasn't for them this wouldn't this video wouldn't have been possible guys so shout outs to them they have a youtube channel i'll be basically linking on my disc in my description also the link to download this software from as well as um putting them in the video tag so you guys can definitely check them out and, su and support them in this video definitely go ahead and show them some love subscribe to the channel they're the ones that made this mod and without them this what this mod wouldn't be possible now just let's go ahead and go into the video and basically tell you guys how to basically download and install this mod all right guys now the first thing you want to do is go on the link in the description this is the github page where you're gonna be installing the mod from are the crewmate from the crew link sorry now once you go ahead you're gonna hit install instructions it's gonna bring you down to this pot here you can either just click hit that or just scroll down you're gonna hit um, that same thing there and once you hit that same link it's gonna um, ask you to download from that section but just hit the link and download. it's like 54 megabytes 56 megabytes about that in range and after doing so it will basically download a new computer now I've already installed this on my computer the next step is just installing this mod and it is pretty simple there's nothing to set up in the mod itself everything is just already set up already um, built in baked into this app you don't need to put any values or change any audio levels only thing you need to do is add your headphones and your microphone into this app and that's pretty much it. it's really pretty it's a really easy install so the next thing you want to do is click on the crew link software after clicking on the crew link software it will then slowly open and once it's open you just hit open game and that should be it once you hit open game it will launch your game from wherever you have it stored which either it's the steam directories or your if it's a cracked version of the game, it will find it. And I should 100% think so, it will find your game and open it up. Now, once it's open, the game will actually display that you're in the menus, so you're gonna either host or join a new server. Now, once you join a new server, you will then go into a lobby or a, a game itself. Once you're in there, it will show um, your audio levels, if you're talking or not that's pretty much it now there's one thing to note guys now to set up your headphones the game has to be launched 100% and after launching you're gonna go to the settings section off the cooling software and go to it and switch the headphones and microphones that you have selected now it might pick the default ones you have on your computer so if you're using a laptop and you have your um, your computer mic set for the, the default and your your microphone speakers for your computer speakers it will go to those as default now you need to go ahead and switch those to your headsets so if you're using a headset you're gonna have to switch it to that and switch your microphone to the mic you have installed or plugged in make sure you know the name so you can actually click it click on it and get it selected now once you have that selected you should be able the person that's in the match with you should be able to hear you and your friends have to have this installed as well so it won't work unless your friends have this mod as well so both persons have to have this this mod simultaneously launched for it to work now for persons who don't have it installed you will see a red ring around their icons or their names or just no they're, they're basically the icons because they don't it won't be a name they're just their colors and will show you um, a red ring around their avatar now that's basically how you know that it's not working for those players now let's do this richie go ahead and talk all right so i'm just talking to make sure Maybe 
you guys should go ahead and subscribe to YouTube. Everyone on YouTube is trying to grow their YouTube channel, so you subscribe. Anyway. So guys, as you can see that this um, new um, link is way, way further. The distance is um, very further from the other, like the other one with this, the proximity chat. Now, if you guys look, you can see how I'm, I have to be I'm like to really hopefully. far away from him for it to even realize that it, I'm, I'm at a good distance for it to stop. So, I mean, proximity is better with that because you can actually, um, actually tune it to how far distance you want it to be, which is cool. All right, guys. So I went ahead and wanted to test to see if when I kill sloppy, it would actually have if you still hear me or if the dead persons do have proximity now after killing him i realized this was so true when he died he could still hear me but only if his ghost was next to me so if he if he left my body or left where i am and went to the next side of the map he wouldn't hear me which is pretty cool and that basically shows that the ghosts do have proximity on them as well which is nice proximity mod it's much longer and has more tweaking in it so you can set it up to make it perfect with with this one it's just everything is already set up there's nothing to change in this mod now i wish they probably could implement a dialer so persons can be able to switch that dialer and turn it down and turn it back up which would be a cool feature for a lot of people now that's pretty much pretty much it guys for this mod if you guys um should get this mod it'll be a cool thing to have versus the proximity mod but i think both mods are pretty unique and you should go ahead and pick between either using this one which is easier to set up or using the proximity mod the proximity mod which is the original one just setting it up and everything but well, that's gonna be it guys peace